435 pounds, Epico and Primo. This tag team match is underway. Not today, too fast. Epico reverses it. Epico is hoping to live up to the legacy of his uncle, the Puerto Rican legend, Carlos Colon. Good teamwork there. Right hand by Randy. Won't expect a lot of mercy to be shown here. Never ever underestimate the sheer force behind this superstar's punches. Ouch! When you watch Orton in a match like this, it's like he goes into some sort of zone. He's in some sort of strange place in his head. You could almost describe his emotion at times as emotionless. Well, maybe his face is emotionless, but I think there's all sorts of evil things going on in that sadistic mind of his. There he goes. Oh my gosh, that was an incredibly risky maneuver to the outside. You can practically see the pain in his face right now, thanks to that tremendous move off the ropes. Three! Come on, come on. Oh, right into that ring post. The range of emotions here is startling. There's almost an unknowing of what to expect. the cover. Primo's got a very impressive pedigree. His dad was a huge superstar around the world. With a cover now. Look at him unloading with the Dez Press. After all of these shots to the head, I've got a feeling that Soup's going to be on his diet for the foreseeable future. Now bringing in his partner. Nice dodge there. I just can't get over the physicality of this match. This has been brutal. Great counterattack there by Primo. That wasn't very accurate. The tension, the drama. This is electric. Rucarana, just how fast is this guy? Oh, what a clothesline. And there are those biting, icy eyes. The venomous look of Randy Orton. What an impact from that kick. And Primo comes up with a big counter. Primo needs to shake the cobwebs out. Randy Orton moves like a world champion. He's just so talented. done by Primo. I can't believe everything that's transpired thus far. It's been so physical. Oh, big right hand. Orton delivered that like a shotgun blast. He may have an ego, but when you're as good as Randy Orton, you have the right to be a little cocky. The Viper controlling the head. Oh, no. Oh. We're in the feeling out process here. Who's going to get the advantage and maintain control? And Orton just took... I think he's through playing around! That's it. He's done. A quick cover. There he goes! Out of the ring! Oh, no! Man, his head just bounced off the floor there. Man, 
this is one of those matches you just like to sit back and enjoy watching. Oh, nice reversal by Epico there. And it looks like we could be heading back into the ring. was going for the RKO. Oh, Randy Orton was so close to finishing him there. Oh, no! There's the pin! Can his opponent kick out? Orton. This match has been 100 miles an hour since the opening bell. The referee getting involved now. These superstars are so unpredictable. I'm having a hard time figuring out what they're going to do next. There's the tag. Epico is hurt, and he finally gets out of the ring. These athletes seem to have tried everything in their playbook. Oh, there's more in their arsenal. I promise you that. I don't know what it is, but they'll find it. He's spending more time outside the ring than in it. King, why is Daniel Bryan successful? This kid is a great wrestling technician. I mean, he knows every hole, every counter, and he knows when to use it. He's going for the pin. This could be it. Primo turned it around. And he touches that one. Epico saw that one coming. This kid trained under Shawn Michaels. And right now, I don't know if there's a better submission artist competing in the WWE. Oh, Daniel, looking for the submission. Epico's been performing. And will this be it? Two. Three. Daniel Bryan wins. You want to talk about a tag team war? We most definitely witnessed just that. This was from bell to bell, a clinic in tag team wrestling. Kudos to all competitors.